In this lesson, we are going to practice multiplying mixed numbers together. When multiplying mixed numbers together, the first thing that we have to accomplish is to change each of the mixed numbers into improper fractions. To do this, we simply rewrite the denominator exactly how it is. For 3 and 3 fifths, we keep the denominator as 5, and for 2 and 1 half, we just rewrite the denominator as 2. The denominators will not change when multiplying mixed numbers together. However, we will have a different numerator. For 3 and 3 fifths, what you do is you multiply the denominator times the whole number, so we take 5 times 3, which gives us a product of 15, and then we add the numerator to 15, which is 15 plus 3, and that will give us 18. For 2 and 1 half, we multiply 2 times 2, which is 4, and then we add 1, which is 5. This gives us the problem 18 fifths times 5 halves. Once you have changed both of your mixed numbers into improper fractions, you check to see if you can perform any cancellation. When canceling numbers, keep in mind you can only do one number at the top and one number at the bottom at a time. You cannot cross off two numerators at a time or two denominators. It must be one at the top and one at the bottom, and each of the numbers that you cancel out must share a common factor. Preferably, you should try to find the greatest common factor because it will reduce the number to the lowest possible terms. For example, let's take the number 18 on the top and the number 2 at the bottom. 2 is the greatest common factor that can be divided into 18 and 2. 2 can be divided into 18 9 times, and 2 can be divided into itself once. So when we cross off the 18, we're going to change that into 9, and when we cross off the 2, we're going to change that into the number 1. Now, we can also cross off the number 5 on the top and the number 5 at the bottom. Whenever the numbers are exactly the same, you can simply cross them off and change them into the number 1. So now that leaves us with 9 over 1 times 1 over 1. When you are through canceling, you simply multiply the numerators times a numerator and the denominator times a denominator. With this example, that would be 9 times 1 is 9 for the numerator and 1 times 1 for the denominator. That gives us 9 over 1, which is an improper fraction. Now we must simplify. Because it is an improper fraction, we take the numerator and divide it by the denominator. 9 divided by 1 is 9. Now you should be a pro at multiplying mixed numbers together.